going into an airport can be overwhelming with bright lights and loud noises. Large crowds of people can also be a trigger. The sense room at the Lehigh Valley Airport is basically a tiny room where individuals with autism and other disabilities could go in and just calm before getting on a flight. The sensory room has been a valuable asset for those individuals that are traveling with autism or other intellectual or developmental disabilities. It's really made people that thought of traveling as a dream a reality. This project uh, really started here within the arc of Lehigh and Northampton counties. We always did our Wings for All program uh, here at the airport, which is a dress rehearsal for those individuals with autism and other intellectual and developmental disabilities to come through the airport, experience what can be hectic and overwhelming for anyone that's traveling. But we thought, how do we take it to the next level? And we're so proud to be able to offer this to air travelers throughout the Lehigh Valley and region. The Arc of Philadelphia is an advocacy organization that supports individuals with intellectual disabilities and developmental delays to make sure that they have the same rights as anyone else in the community, school, or home. It becomes a better experience for everyone involved because we're showing the community we're here to support you and we're giving you the tools to be successful when you come out into the community. As a father of someone with a disability, anything that I know that is supporting my family encourages me to go to that particular business instead of another and really helps me get out into the community more. It's indescribable, really. Um, you know, it may seem like a little thing to some people, but to a family like ours, it's a really big thing. When we are traveling as a family, it's not just stressful for the individual with autism who is elevating in his sensory needs, but it's stressful for the family as well because, of course, you're worried about catching your plane and having everything that you need as well as the comfort of your child. If you were to go to the sensory room now, you would see fiber optic lighting compression canoe, game and chairs that kids could rock in. We actually went in, designed the room with the airport, and then we provide all of the products. And it was really great because in the creation of the room, we had self-advocates kind of helping us out. You know, there with a the paintbrush and a hammer and a nail. We went to spackle the walls, so that was an awesome experience. Uh, so it really was not only just for the community, it was by the community. And that, you know, is the rewarding in and of itself. We were really excited to launch the Sensory Room in May of 2018. This room has a variety of components that really target particular senses, whether it be tactile, auditory, or visual, to help keep a person calm before navigating to the next part of their flight. Seeing how successful that was and how it encouraged families to travel at a greater rate, we decided how can we continue to provide supports for individuals. The Ink Pass or Inclusive Pass program that we developed trains employees on how to engage with customers with intellectual disabilities and developmental delays. It allows me the opportunity to support people that truly need the support. I would encourage other businesses to train their employees because it's helpful for everyone. Liked what you saw? Subscribe to our channel so you never miss another video. To see more of The Peak TV, check out our website, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and catch us on WFMZ Channel 69.